Happy Monday. I cannot believe it's already January 22nd. This year is going to fly by as fast, if not faster than last year. I feel like we've just blinked and January is almost over. So I hope that you're making the most out of every day because you'll never get this day again. Today, I'm going to be reading from the language of letting go January 22nd topic is about appreciating our past. It is easy to be negative about past mistakes and unhappiness, but it is much more healing to look at ourselves and our past in the light of experience, acceptance, and growth. Our past is a series of lessons that advance us to higher levels of living and loving. The relationships we entered, stayed in, or ended taught us necessary lessons. Some of us have emerged from the most painful circumstances with strong insights about who we are and what we want. Our mistakes, necessary. Our frustrations, failures, and sometimes stumbling attempts at growth and progress, necessary too. Each step of the way we learned, we went through exactly ex the experiences we need to, to become who we are today. Each step of the way we progress. Is our past a mistake? No. The only mistake we can make is mistaking that for the truth. Today, God, help me let go of negative thoughts I may be harboring about my past circumstances or relationships. I, I can accept with gratitude all that has brought me today. And that's something that I share openly all the time is that I dwelled on the past. I let the past define me. I took everything personal. I allowed myself to be the victim and I asked why me? And when I got, the, when I asked those questions, the answers that came back were not good because you're stupid, because you're not deserving, because you're not worthy, because of this and that. And then I finally woke up and realized that I am not any different than anybody else that the struggles that I have may be worse or better or the same as others, but we all have struggles. And when I finally decided that I was going to take the things that happened to me and learn from them, and then once I learned from them, help others, then it started to make sense that my pain was, wasn't for nothing and that I wasn't alienated in this world with I wasn't the only person with problems and it's helped me by opening up talking about these things accepting them I found other people who feel the same way or have experienced the same thing and we have banded together and been able to heal and so whatever you're struggling with honestly I think about all the times that I thought the sky was falling and now looking back they were just parts of life. And many of them I learned lessons from and it's helped me to not make the same mistakes. And, you know, I see some of the people making the same, you know, um, mistakes or, or living the same year over and over and over again. And these things keep presenting themselves until you finally learn the lesson and know what the right answer is to do or how to move forward from it, or it's, it's just gonna keep coming up. And so that has helped me big time is seeing my past for what it was as a learning experience and things that shaped me into who I am today. So hopefully this has been helpful.